Welcome to Ballotpedia's Daily Brew, your nonpartisan and unbiased source for political news. It's July 26, 2024, and I'm kicking off today's briefing with our Did You Know question of the day. Did you know? Most mayoral offices in the U.S. are officially nonpartisan. Currently, among the 100 most populous U.S. cities, 63 mayors are Democrats, 25 are Republican, one is Libertarian, five are officially nonpartisan, four are Independents, and two mayors' affiliation is unknown. On to school board election news from Oklahoma, where the Sequoia Public Schools will have a court-ordered redo election on August 27th. While they are rare, most redo elections take place at the municipal or county level. There have been only two congressional redo elections in the last 50 years. Usually, states or courts only call for a redo election if the number of ballots affected is large enough to change the outcome of the election. Other reasons include electoral fraud, natural disasters, or issues with voting technology. For more details on the situation in Sequoia and other noteworthy redo elections, check the link in our bio. Next up, ballot measures, a favorite topic of ours here at Ballotpedia. So far this year, 136 statewide ballot measures have been certified in 39 states. In the past two weeks, election officials certified 11 ballot measures in seven states, Idaho, Massachusetts, Nevada, Ohio, Oregon, South Dakota, and Washington. The range of topics on these measures spans ranked choice voting, access to psychedelic substances, repealing high school graduation competencies assessments, and voter identification to wages for tipped employees and tax revenue rebates. And that is a wrap. For more information on any of today's news or to get it delivered to your inbox, click the link in our bio to subscribe and read online. Thank you.